My name is Max Donovan, and I'm a paranormal investigator. I've been investigating Freddy's for over five years now, and I know... I know I'm close to finding out what happened. Mysterious disappearances, possible murders, no bodies, no nothing. I, 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 I need to know what happened. It could, it could be my breakthrough. It could solidify me as the man who solved Freddy's. Attached to this note is the key to Fredbear's. I cannot disclose my name, my origins, or how I found you, but I will meet you there. Signed by him. This is it, where it all started. go together.
Hello there, new night guard, and welcome to my establishment. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, Henry. I'll give you the quick rundown on how the animatronics and the building systems you requested actually function. First up, you have your cameras up front. Activate them by pressing space on the keyboard in front of you. You can press S to exit back out. I took the liberty to go into some state-of-the-art tech for us here, and a screen that can detect your fingers' locations with invisible lasers. Pretty fancy stuff. Anyway, touch a on your buttons to switch cameras. Any room with a green triangle can be selected. Even the vents. Now, you also have your alarm and air refresh buttons. For now, you'll only need the alarm. Pressing it will signal a bright, loud, and red alarm to ring in whatever room you have selected on the camera. You can ring the alarm near your office by using the left shift key. And now on to your animatronic buddies, courtesy of me, of course. <clears throat> Fred Bear is up first. I gave him the role of power management, basically. If he noticed a lack of people, he will go into different rooms and try and find guests or staff members. And if he decides the place is completely empty, he'll shut off the power. Not something you want now, is it? Now, all you have to do is lead him to you. He'll go after any noise, so whenever he's taking a break to take in any sounds or signals, try ringing the alarms in nearby rooms, leading him towards you a couple of times. Once he's close enough, say, Party Room 1, then ring the alarm near your office. That's a shift key, remember? Bonnie, however, is a bit of a different beast. You'll wander around looking for intruders. Normally, if you wear your guard uniform, you'll read a chip inside it and not register you as an intruder. However, you didn't exactly fit the last guard's uniform, so until you can tailor yourself a new one, just try to avoid any contact with him. But if he does manage to enter your office, try and stay completely still. One of his parameters for checking if someone's human is if it moves. Thusly, if you stay completely still, he probably won't register you as a human, and thus, not as an intruder. Alright! Hope you got all that. Good luck, and I'll see you tomorrow.
house is this?